Hi, this is Kanna Babu. This is part 2 of previous video. In this video, we will discuss about how to display the end maximum salary by using top function. First of all, initially we must know about top function, right? So here, for example, this is my table. Select a star from EMP. Press F5. Now, for example, if I ask you to write a query to display the uh, top 5 records from the table. So you can write the query something like this. Select top 5 star from EMP. Press F5. So the top 5 records will display. Now if I ask you write a query to display the first record from the table. I want the only the first record that is Robert. So here how to write the query. Select top 1 star from EMP. The above query will display what? Only the first record. If I ask you write a query to display the last record from the table. Last record means what? I want Omar, 10th record. So how can I get? I'll write the query like this. Select top 1 star from EMP. Order by E number DESC. So how this query will execute? First of all, order by class. We'll arrange the employee numbers in descending order. And then... Descending order means my 10 Omar will come on the top and then top function will work. Select top 1 star from EMP. So Omar will be displayed. So let us see here. Press F5. Hope you understood. Whenever you use top and order by, first priority was given for what? Order by class. And then the top function will be work. Means the result of the query is something like this. Here first it will execute this one. Which one? Order by class. Right, then Omar has the result of this query is first order by class will arrange the employee details in descending order based on E number and then top one will come from that result set that is 10th record will come. Hope you understood. Now, if I ask you write a query to display um, fifth record from the table, so how to write the query? Select top, I will write the uh, inner query. First of all, I will write the inner query. Select top 5 star from EMP. Order by order by salary. Order by salary. So what is the order, sorry, order by E number I will write. Order by E number. So what is the result of this query? It will give the first 5 records. But I want only the 5th record. Is it clear? So, order by class will arrange the employee details in ascending order. And then here I will write select uh, top 1 star from, from class I will use. Is it clear? And I will store the result here R. So, what is the output select top 1 star from R? What is the result uh, that is stored in R? These top 5 records are stored in R. Now read the query, select top 1 star from R. Top 1 means I will get a robot, but I want what? Current. So here I will use again order by, order by uh, E number DESC. Here you check this query, press F5. I got the fifth record. So how this query will execute? For example, I want a fourth record. Let us see whether it is working or not. Fourth record. I want 8th record. Let us see whether it is working or not. 8th record. So my query is perfectly working. So how the query is executed? That will play the major role here. So here, I want the 5th record. Now, always in subquery, the inner query will get executed. This is my inner query. And how in this inner query, first priority given for what? Order by class. Order by class will arrange the employee details in ascending order based on E number. Ascending order based on E number. Is it clear? So here, if I ask you write a query to display that I want fifth record. So, order by class will arrange the employee details in ascending order. So, fifth record will be in which position? Fifth position only. And top five will get what? The top five records. So, top five records will come. So, first order by class, then top function. And then, the result of the inner query is stored in R. What is the result of the inner query? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. These 5 records are stored in R. Now read the outer query. Select top 1 star from R. Order by E number descending order. In this statement, 
first priority given for order by class. Now order by class will arrange the employee details in descending order. That is my 5 will come in which position? First position. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now select top 1 star from R. So what is my first position value? 5. So that record will be displayed. Hope you understood. Is it clear? Now my requirement is I want to write a query to display the nth maximum salary of an employee. Select star from EMP. I want to display the fifth maximum salary of an employee. This is my table. So how to write the query? First of all what I will do means I will arrange all the salary in descending order. When I arrange the salary in descending order, the top maximum salary will come in which place? First place. The fifth maximum salary will come in which place? Fifth place. The second maximum salary will be in second place. Is it clear? I will arrange the salary in descending order. So 25,000 will come in first place. 24 second place. So 25,000 is the first max salary. I hope you understood. So I'll write the query like this. Something like the inner query I will write. Select I will use distinct because I don't want to. Uh, maintain the duplicate values. Select distinct top 5 salary from EMP. I will use order by order by salary DSC. So what is the result of this query? The result of the query distinct will arrange. Now it will consider the common values in a single column as one value. So first uh, order by class. Step number 1 is order by class will arrange the salary in descending order. So here you see 25, 24, 23, 22, 21. Now select distinct top 5. What top function will do? It will get the first top 5 salary. 25, 24, 23, 22, 21. Now I want which salary? 5th max salary. 5th max salary means that is what? This one. Say so again what I want to do? I want to store the result in one variable r. And again I will arrange this r in uh, ascending order. Is it clear? Then my 21,000 will come in which place? First place. Then I will write top 1. Let us see here. I will store the result of the query in where? R. Are you following? So, I will try to write the outer query. Select uh, top 1 star from glass I will use. Select top 1 star from R order by order by E number order by salary are you following so how it is working this is the output of which query inner query let us assume this is my what r this is my r that is my result set r i am storing the result in r now how, the result of the inner query is this one now read the outer query select top one star from r order by salary so first order by class will arrange the salary in which order ascending order so here first of all you will get 21,000, next 22,000, next 23,000, next 24,000, next 25,000. That is the job of what? Order by class. You will arrange the salary in ascending order. Then top function will get the top one salary. Top one is 21,000. That is fifth max salary. I hope you understood. This is the performance wise. This query is 100% better compared with the previous self chart. Is it clear? See, first of all, order by salary will arrange the salary in descending order. As here only, if you observe clearly, for example, I have 100 salaries are there. I will arrange all the salaries in descending order. Now my top salary will come in which place? First place, first max sal. So, and then I want to what top 5. Top 5 means first 5 will come. Is it clear? Now my 50 salary in which place? 5th place. So, now what I will do? This is my 5th max cell actually. So, I want to display the 5th max cell. So, what I will do means, again I will try to apply order by class for the result. Here R. R is nothing but the alias name. It is a temporary memory where the result of the query is stored here in R. Now, order by salary. What order by salary will do? It will again by default order by class will arrange the data in ascending order. It will arrange the result of R in which order ascending order. So 21, 22, 23, 24, 25 came. Next is select top 1. 
top one means which salary is this one 25 my 20, my 21000 my fifth max sal will be in the top place now because we arrange again in ascending order that is our fifth max sal press f5 that is your fifth max sal if you want uh, first max sal here write one second max sal 24000 third max sal 23 fourth max sal is it clear fifth max sal 21 Sixth max cell, twenty thousand. Seventh max cell, I think it is not there, so it did not come. I hope you understood. Is it clear? So in this manner you can work with what? Query to display the end maximum salary by using what? Top function. Right? This query is uh, under per um, the performance way. This query is hundred percent better compared with your self join. Hope you understood. For more videos, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and Facebook group. Thank you. Have a nice day.